Hello and welcome back. We are quickly moving onwards to the used ship emporium of Stan. And we're here. Howdy. Howdy. I'm Stan of Stan's previously owned vessels. So and I'd stand on my head to make you a deal. It's a pattern. What's sort of you looking for? Um, Big, fast, slow. You want it? I got it. And if I don't got it, I'll get it. I want to make you a deal that you're happy with. Because if you're not happy, I'm not happy. But I know you're going to leave here happy today. How do I know? Just look at all these ships. Mm -hmm. And I've got something for everyone. Come, take a look around. Okay. So tell me. What are you interested in looking at today? Uh, let me see the best ship you got. Let me see the best ship you've got. Hey, it's nice to meet a man who appreciates quality. I've got just the boat for you. Walk this way. <sighs> now mm -hmm. this... This is a ship fit for a king. I mean, we're talking 15 staterooms, a fireplace in every one. We're talking two pools, one indoor, one outdoor. We're talking rotating ballroom. We're talking heated crow's nest. You're a neat we're talking set. 200 feet of ocean going decadence. And all for one low price. Speaking of price, let's talk about money. Your money. Um, I don't like where this is going. To get one on credit. Actually, I was hoping to get one on credit. Sorry, kid. Neither a borrower nor a lender be. That's just old Stan's philosophy. If you've got a job, the storekeeper in town might extend you some credit. Then we'd have something to talk about. Unless, of course, you've already got some other means of financing. <laughs> no more than 173 pieces of eight. 371 pieces of eight. I think we must be talking about completely different ships here. You've obviously been out of the ship market for quite some time. I doubt you're carrying enough cash on you for this transaction. You wouldn't happen to have any other means of finance, would you? Uh, second thought, this may not be the uh, ship for me. This may not be the ship for me. Well, heck, I can understand that. Nothing wrong with being indecisive, even if it is a waste of my time. Um. So, what else can I show you? Something not too expensive, but built to last. Don't have that much to spend. I don't really have that much to spend. Have no fear. Every ship I sell is a bargain. But if you're looking for a real steal, I've got just the boat for you. Walk this way. This here is the famous Sea Monkey. Oh. The only ship ever to make it to Monkey Island <gasps> and come back with anyone aboard left alive. Or should I say anything? You see, the previous owners of the ship were two adventurous pirates. They set off, like many before, to find the legendary secret of Monkey Island. Trademark. And like many before, they disappeared forever. Their oh. fate? A mystery. Almost as mysterious as how this ship returned to Melee Island without a single human aboard. Some claim it was sailed back by a crew of chimps. Chimps? There aren't any chimps in the Caribbean. <laughs> oh, shut up. It makes a good story. <laughs> well, anyway, this baby's mine now. That is, until someone makes me an offer. How much would you like to spend? Um, this rubber chicken. I have 371 pieces of eight. Look, this is a very reasonably priced ship, but not that reasonable. <laughs> I don't think you've got the cash for this transaction either. 
You do have some other means of payment, don't you? Uh, on second thought, this may not be the ship for me. Money is no object. Well, it is with me. How much you got? On second thought, this may not be the ship for me. Okay, but I got five other guys coming back to look at this baby today. Don't count on it being here if you change your mind. So, what else can I show you? Well, we ain't getting any headway with this guy. Think about it some more. Actually, I'd like to go think about it some more. Sure, sure, think it over. I don't want you to feel pressured or anything. Bye now. Let's go and I forgot Whoa. to give you my card. And here's something else to remember me by. A compass? An extra strong magnetic compass. With your picture on it. That's right. It always points directly back here, so if you're looking for a good deal, you know where to go. I'll be right here when you come back, but I can't guarantee that any of these ships will... Right. Would it be really counterproductive to have a magnetic compass? Today. Yes, sirree. Can't hardly keep anything in stock. He'll be back. We got a business card and a compass. Um, let's go to the island, I guess. Come on, Guybrush, speed it up. Put a bit of spring in your step. You're on a life and death situation here. We're here. Let's use the rubber chicken. Here we go. Maybe Meatok will be willing to come with us on our journey. On our gurney. Souvenirs. Hook Island. Hello, meat hook. I told you, I don't have the time to show you any more tattoo tricks. The governor has been kidnapped. The governor's been kidnapped. What? That's preposterous. Oh, really? Take a look at this note they left. Oh, no. This is horrible. What are we going to do? We need to uh, wait here for them to come back. The crew together and sail off after them. What an idea! If we only had a captain. What about me? You? Well, that's rude. Yeah, that's. You are hurting my feelings here. I'm serious. Really? Really? Okay, let's see you prove it. Walk this way. <sighs> we are in the home. There's something in here that I want to show you. Something horrible. Oh. Something so horrible that I stay awake at night just thinking about it. But I don't mean to scare you. I'm sure a big brave guy like yourself will have no problem facing this monster. After all, it's much smaller than the beast that bit off my hands so many years ago. Arr, 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 arr. Let's just hope you're quicker than I was. Oh, I just remembered something. I never did get around to feeding him this week. This week? <laughs> Silly it's me! Not good. I'll let you open this last door yourself. Just Someone's nailing something. I hope my neighbor nails a pretty painting on the wall. Getting 
cold feet? No, I just don't know what I'm supposed to do. <laughs> you're supposed to open that little door. And if you're brave enough, touch the beast inside. Oh, oh that all? Going to touch the beast. Okay, go ahead. If you've got the guts. That's open the hatch next episode. <laughs> Until then.